Okay, here this is Legato, and what I'm going to do this time is teach you how to make staircase. Very simple, very bare bones, uh, just using the block tool. What I've got here is a square room with a light, two player start points. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a staircase that goes up into this corner and then up again into another landing. Okay, very simple. We're just going to use the block tool to create this staircase. What we do is we make a, um, a simple block on the floor, like I have here, that's probably just about boot high. So if you put the, the player start point next to the uh, next to the block and have a look on your side view, just about the same height as the boot. That's about the right height. What we want to do now is you're still using the side view. Obviously you can make the staircase as wide or as narrow as you want using the top down view but that's fairly obvious. I'm going to have it about that wide, that's enough. Now in the side view what you want to do is hold shift and left click and drag and what that does is duplicates the item. Okay. What you want to do is keep doing that into the corner obviously to make a square um, a staircase shape Yeah, to as high as you want. So just keep going. Each time dragging it to the corner of the next one. Just like that. Okay. I need to do a few more. The staircase isn't quite high enough. But that should be about enough. Okay. So as you can see now, we've got ourselves. I'm just going to texture it so you can see the difference. So I textured the front of each step different. But as you can see basically we've just got a group of blocks that are up the corner from the next one all the way up. Yeah, very simple. What I want to do now is obviously if you do want to be able to get underneath the stairs, just leave it leave it black uh, leave it blank like that. That's no problem. But like me, I'm not all that keen on doing that. So what I'm gonna do is create another block that starts from the basically covers the the, the um, basically covers the blocks starting from the, the you know where you started right from where you started create the block right the way up to where you finished okay so in effect you're creating a block that encases your entire staircase okay so from the cor top corner right down to the bottom corner flush with the floor okay what you want to do now is take your clip tool, press it once, and then right down into the corner. If you left click and then drag, you'll end up with this arrow, uh, this line, basically where you're going to cut. So, what you want to do is go from the bottom of your staircase, right in the corner, right up to the top in the other corner okay now obviously the red part is where it's going to be cut off and the white part is going to be where it's kept so obviously as you can see mine's the wrong way around so what I'm going to do is I'm going to press the clip tool again as you can see it jumps so I'll show you again the bottom where, where the red lines are on the clip is going to be lost and where the white line is going to be kept so I click the clip tool and they jump round so if I press enter now, as you can see, the outside gets cut, but the inside gets kept. So now we have a basic wedge shape with a staircase on. That's great, but I'm going to double this up and get it higher. So what I'm going to do is hold control and select all of it. And this tool here, IG, just press that once and that groups them all together hold shift and drag and I can create another staircase and as with everything else if you left click inside a selected item you get different stuff so that's size and then you can change the rotation so if I turn the rotation I can turn my new staircase 90 degrees line it up with the other wall 
and a staircase and I basically have another staircase that's great what we need to do now though is create a landing so if we just create another block it's flush in the corner what I have in effect now is another staircase and as with before using the clipping tool what I'm going to do is create a wedge underneath the stairs just to beef them out and make them look a little more sturdy so using the clipping tool from one corner to the other staircase and just cutting it off like so perfect create another block underneath and what we have is a staircase two flighted staircase from the bottom all the way up to the top and as you can see that's very simple all it's a case of is using the block tool to create and carve uh, to create and manipulate the, uh, the block tool to exactly what you want it's very simple it's just like building our blocks obviously you can now add props like handles and stuff to make it look a bit more professional and proper but you basically have the very basics to creating a, a staircase hopefully that's um, helped you I look forward to seeing you in my next tutorial